All right, guys, I'm going to show you how to use the slot tool real quick. Um, the slot is basically, if we go into sketch, I'm going to sketch on the top plane. Um, the slot is basically uh, a rectangle with semicircles at either end. All right, so you might have a shape that, that requires that sort of shape. So we're going to. Um, just make a line to start, and if you know the dimensions uh, of the distance from the center of the one semicircle to the center of the other semicircle, then that's the dimension you want to put in here. So let's say it's one inch, just to give us something to work with. All right, so now that I've made my line, now again, if I'm making an object, I, I might want the origin to be the midpoint of that line, right? So if I, if I really want my object to be somewhat symmetrical, then I'm gonna make sure that I choose um, the line and the midpoint, or the origin, and then go up here and choose a midpoint constraint. That way it's perfectly centered. That may or may not be what you need, but it's something to consider. All right, so now I'm gonna go make a slot. So I'm gonna click on slot, and when I choose slot, I gotta choose my line and then it gives me a diameter um, that I can work with. So I can double click in that diameter and I can choose whatever diameter I want to. So, uh, you know, a half inch is probably fine. Maybe it's a 0.25 inch diameter, all right? But once I'm done, you'll notice that there's a little mouse that shows up and I'm gonna click out of that. If I'm on the iPad, I would just tap somewhere outside and I have a slot. So if I were creating something, for instance, that um, needed to be an extruded slot, then I would just take that now, do an extrusion of whatever amount I want. So let's say it's a half inch. All right, now I have an extruded slot. All right, so I don't have to do any filleting or anything like that. I just have a slot to begin with. 